It's tough, you know, like, I mean, obviously you want to be in the starting 11, but, um, you know, the coach only, you know, ha he makes his decisions and, you know, you just got to be hard. You got to be hard in practice. You, you got you to gotta make it hard on the starting 11, you know, not, it's not given to them. Um, you know, that's why I end up kicking Logan. <laughs> um, I didn't, I didn't think about soccer to be honest you know I uh, my dad owns his own business so I wanted to be some I'm pretty I'm pretty entrepreneur as they say as since I was a kid so I thought I was gonna do something in the business world but um, soccer just kind of fell into my feet and I mean obviously every kid wants to play pro but you gotta you know I mean there was 1% make it so I was always thinking okay well I'll go to school and get an education and then see what happens I mean, I've always been, since I became a professional soccer player, uh, a guy that interacts with fans. Um, I feel it's important. It's a reason why we do what we do, you know, and um, they're the reason, you know, we come and that's our stadium is like our like playground and, you know, they, and they come and watch us and it, we're entertainment for them. So I feel like just leaving after a game and, you know, not saying hi to them, it's, you know, kind of a, you know, leaves a bad taste for me. So I always, after, every game go interact with somebody and that's the way I've always done it and I always will. Better place to hang out, tattoo parlor or ice cream parlor? Tattoo parlor. Twitter or Facebook or both? Twitter. The entrance music was a, was a thing in soccer, what song would you pick? Maybe the Rocky Balboa song. I have a tiger. Best dinner spot in Chicago. Ooh, can I say two? Sure. Sunda and Vapianos. Do your best Frank Klobos impersonation. That was a disaster.